doing mobile apps is not easy. Like it requires a lot of learning, uh, a lot of framework specific knowledge, uh, which, well, if you're developing a product uh, and you want to develop a product for Android and iOS, the assumption is that yeah, you will, I will have to hire like a group of Android engineers and a group of iOS engineers. And so there, there are like uh, a huge group of, uh, of apps that will benefit from actually just uh, writing a single code base and being able to write, uh, to, to ship up for both Android and iOS reusing the same concepts. So uh, it actually, it, the framework is really powerful. Again, has been used in production by a lot of big companies. Uh, and and we are we Meta are also using that in production in several of our apps, um, and so so yeah. And to add also uh, one little note for for the future, um, you're probably familiar with uh, uh, Meta Quest, the former Oculus product. Those are running uh, React internally, so. Um, this is a proof of how flexible this framework is and how extensible it can become. So yeah, and it's all open source. Like we're not selling it. Like you can literally take the code, clone it, do whatever you want. Maybe you build your own hardware and you can create UI for it with React Native. Obviously you will need some adaptations, but yeah, uh, it's it's all open source and all done for the sake of sharing knowledge with the rest uh, of the open source community. Mm -hmm.